Hello, everybody. Ugh, welcome back <laughs> to Road 96. In the last episode, episode two, uh, so we got ourselves into some hot water. Not my fucking problem. And <laughs> uh, we got to meet John finally. We met the brigades and the leader of the brigades. Uh, we also met up with Stan and Mitch. My, my favorite brotherly duo uh, and got to ride around in their motorcycle. We found out that there is a potential that Jared, the cab driver, uh, is a psychopath and also a serial killer uh, and may or may not be going after Sonia for some reason. We don't know why, uh, but we did get Alex's hacking ability. So now we can hack into everything. We are now hacker person, so awesome. We did make it out, not a problem at all. So let's carry on, shall we? Hello, Sonia Sanchez July here. 5th. Welcome to the Sonia Show. You know that Sonia has the best news, right? Mm. Well, Debatable. I've heard that the brigades have recently held a secret meeting. Ah, uh, right. We called. <laughs> that they now plan to attack as many innocent people as they can to spread their hateful message. <sighs> Despicable, right? But worry not, viewers. Our great leader will crush the insurgents like the bugs that they are. <laughs> if I don't do it myself first, that is. The gate to the border was open today goes to show you how great our nation is because we had as always few requests to work offshore now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate that's poll. how we got off uh got out of the Looks the like country Tyrag by the way still the preferred candidate in a nutshell voting for flores equals voting for violence don't vote for violence Vote for Tyrak. As you know, yeah, I don't think the Sonya you can show say that on the news. Is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Yes, mysteriously. Let's do today's missing teen report. Mm. All right. Remember, so this kid's back again. All right, 18 days, Sonya 17 hotline. bucks. Sorry, 17 years, 16 bucks for energy. Five bucks. He's real far from the border, though. I think I'm gonna go with this kid. We count on your support. I love this song. It's so good. Great start. Great start. Oh my god. Uh, other things that we've learned about the characters along the way is that um, Madam up there, Fanny, she has a child. She is a cop who has a child, and she claims she doesn't believe in the pits, which is... The pits is where the cops send teenagers who may or may not be crossing, uh, basically just any teenager they see that looks suspicious, uh, to go work in the iron pits. It's basically like a labor camp for teenagers. Uh, I guess there was a protest here. Um, and, uh... Yeah... So she claims she doesn't believe in them, but I mean, you know, she's a cop, so she's a liar. Um, and uh, what else did we learn? We learned that Alex's biological parents may or may not have died uh, in the attack of 86, although I'm pretty sure it's canon that they did. Uh, and uh, yeah. No good, flipping tire. What's wrong? Everything okay? Just some car trouble, kid. What are you doing out here? Oh. If it's car trouble, I can help. You changing the subject on me? Oh my god. Well, if you got any advice, I guess it wouldn't hurt to hear it. 
My mom taught me a trick. What are you? A tire whisperer? Good lord, you want my help or not? I have never changed a tire in my life. Something tells me it's not actually this easy. Hey, don't stop there. The pump's behind you. You know, you remind me of my son. He's always fixing things. Always mm. breaking things, too. Here. Thanks. Thanks a lot, kid. Gotta say, I'm impressed. Always looks like it's gonna rain. Oh. Well. Uh, just my luck. Come on, follow me. How did you just pivot on? Why are we going to sit in your cat? Well, it's Alex. Well, well. So we knew that Alex's mom, or adopted mom, was a cop. Turns out it's Fanny. Yes. Uh, I think the brigades are terrorists. Uh huh. After what happened in '86, you're damn right I do. Fair enough. Maybe they had a reason to. Come on. No reason's good enough to kill hundreds of people. Tyrak is the real problem, IMO. Don't recall asking your opinion on that. Whatever. So, bad day, huh? It's been a bad summer, really. Sorry. I just have a lot on my mind. Hey, uh, wanna talk a bit? Don't know why I'm telling you this. Oh, I didn't ask! <laughs> my son. My adopted son. He ran away? Oh, can I ask why? I... I knew something that he didn't. A secret. And when I told him, he got upset. Secrets are dangerous. They really can be. You're right. I told him who his biological parents were. Uh-huh. Or as much as I know about them anyway. Why did you get upset? I always told him I didn't know. Oh, so you I lied to him. Yeah. It was mm -hmm. hard on him, too, because of who they were. Who were they? They were members of the Black Brigades. Right. Heavy stuff. Yeah. I guess it is. How'd you adopt him? You know about the attack in 86, right? Yeah. That's the day I met my son. They brought their child to... Yeah, I was working security. Hired to protect Tyrak at the wall's opening ceremony. Oh. Ah. Uh. Everything was going fine until it wasn't. Hmm. I barely saw the truck before it crashed into the mountain. Just a flash. Next thing I knew, rocks were falling on the crowd. It was awful. That sounds scary. You have no idea. The screams. Everything was just so Yeah, you got PTSD now, terrible. huh? Yeah. At some point, I I looked down and there was my son, silent, covered in dust, looking up at he me. He was a baby? Maybe I shouldn't have. But I I picked him up and brought him home with me. I just had to make sure he was going to be safe. I had to. No one was looking for him? I looked in the papers for months after. Searched the missing children reports every day. There was nothing. It's not unusual for brigades to cut ties with family. Do you think his parents are dead? I do. What other explanation is there? I... I guess I deserve all this. I kept the truth from my baby. Why didn't you tell him sooner? I thought it would hurt him. It did. I think but part of me did not tell him telling him sooner is what hurt him. That I wasn't his real mother. Oh. He'll come back. I hope so. Central to unit two. Hmm. Do you copy? Over. I should get that. Look, kid. I don't know what you're up to out here. 
Just promise me something. What? Turn around and go home. Okay? Your parents miss you. Hmm. I make no promises. <laughs> Absolutely none. Now let's hope I can hitchhike, because I'm real short on cash. Uh, oh, thank God. <laughs> Uh, not cash, but energy. I'm real short on energy, and uh, mm. you know. Oh shit! It's John. <laughs> Talkative type, are you, young blood? Oh, yeah, I guess not. Two hours and you barely said a word. Sorry. Feel free to start a conversation, okay? Oh, he's missing fingers. Sure. Well, this started for a good reason. Yeah. But now, I'm afraid things are getting too radical. What do you think? We didn't do everything the government said we did. Believe me. Get your hand out of there if I were you. Sorry. Sorry. Appreciate it. So I'm just gonna look out the window, I guess, for the next however long. We fell asleep. Papa Bear, got your ears on? What? Over. Ooh, that's Mama Bear, young wolf. That's Fanny. We got a CB type thing going on. Uh huh. I've never actually met her, but oh. I think I'm in love. Uh, Papa Bear and Mama Bear? We got CB nicknames for one another. I'm her papa, she's my mama. I want to ask her out, but I've been out of the game too long. Can you help? I'll, I'll do what I can. Thanks, kid. All right. I'm going in. All right. Hi, beautiful. How's my CB crush doing today? Beautiful? <laughs> well, if you say so. Uh, nice line, John. I'm all right. Oh, but my boss is writing me about this illegal transmitter. I'm a bear as a cop? Yes, she is, young blood. Never thought I'd love a cop before. Honestly? I'm starting to think a ghost is moving in. Speaking of transporting, what are you hauling today, Papa? Something just as intriguing. I like how when you call me Big Papa. <laughs> <laughs> Young blood, it's going well. I'm gonna ask her out. Do it. Any advice? Uh, be yourself. Mama Bear, aren't you getting tired of talking like this? Oh, you, you don't want to talk anymore, Papa? Oh my god, girl, explain what you mean. No, no, what I mean is we, we should meet in person. Look, I know nothing about adult love, CB truth. 32 years old and I don't but know I shit about adult you, love. Oh, uh, I don't know, Papa Bear. What we have is nice. But maybe it is time we met. Oh, you got this, John. You're not messing with me, are you? No. Name the time and place. Oh shit! I'll be there. Woohoo! Yeah! Oh. What the hell? What? What was that? Uh, road pilots, young blood. Road pirates? Get in the back. You know how to handle a nail gun? A nail. These old I think they're gonna get my pineapples. Ha! Can't legally carry a gun, so you'll have to shoot uh. them with nails. Oh, yeah, you know, because that's so much better. 
Uh, what's behind the tower? Oh, that? That's, uh, nothing. Looks like an illegal radio transmitter to me. I'm a crack shot. Shoot the lock to open the doors. Let's go. Take them down, young blood. I wonder how fun it would be. Papa Bear, you think of a time and place? Oh my god. Young Fanny, blood. now is not the time. Mama Bear like seafood? Everyone loves seafood. I mean, she could have allergies, but... Papa Bear? I'm here, darling. You like gumbo? <laughs> Damn, they're back. You like gumbo? Show no mercy! What road are you on, Papa Bear? We got a call. There's a shootout on Route 220. Uh... Oh, really? Get them off, Buck Easter, young blood! John, what are you doing? Jesus! They're pulling up his... That's it, yeah. y'all! Yeah, 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 yeah. These bandidos are almost finished! Here we go. I think I just nailed that guy in the temple with a fucking nail gun. Oh, yeah! Oof. Way to go, young blood! You're a cold-blooded sniper. Yeah, well, you know. You know I got your back, John. Papa Bear, I gotta run. Looking forward to our date. Me too, Mama. You have the transmitter. Hey, that's our little secret, all right? Yeah. Young blood, I'm gonna have to drop you soon. But it's been a blast. Good luck with Mama Bear. I appreciate that, young blood. I hope you reach your destination. Thank you, John. Hope you like gumbo. I hope she likes gumbo. I don't know what it is about that, that, like, that line. It just makes me laugh. You like gumbo? <laughs> it's just so random. Wow. All right, we're moving. We are moving along. Ski daddling, if you will. It's a lot of energy gone. Mm -hmm. All right, what have we got next? Oh, right. So this is one of the ones that are kind of always the same. Um, Usually the third chapter, like the third person you meet in the third chapter is always going to be Zoe, because of course it is. Can I just not? Hey, hey, over here. Help me. No. <laughs> I have to, unfortunately, but. Hello. Coming in. Play music here if we wanted to. Just gonna vandalize that when there's cops right there. Don't mind. What do you want, kid? It's the cops. Their van broke down, I think. A kid like you shouldn't stick around here. Know that? You protesting too? I most definitely am not. These oh. protesters. Wish there was some way we could just ship them out. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, damn, really? I don't have a credit card. Ooh. Wow, thanks for the one whole dollar. I was really hoping that there'd be food here somewhere. But, uh. I don't think there is. Light fire. Yeah, so there's a thing that we're gonna do here, and you can do it in a few different ways. burger bro I need to save all my money all right why are you handcuffed don't let them see you 
What? The cops. They transferred me out of you know where. What, the pits? Why would they do that? My dad must have found out where I was. Right. I shouldn't talk to you. Please. You're my only hope. Get get the van keys from the cops. But you'll need to to distract them somehow. Then come back here. Sorry about that, guys. My video went real weird all of a sudden. I don't know where. Uh, I'll try. Thank you. All right, so we can siphon their gas, which is interesting. Um, but we need to cause a distraction. Know how many times I've called for a tow this year? I don't. Guess how many times? Fine. Three times. Nope. Four times. Can you believe it? What for? Go away before I get angry. Okay, sorry. <laughs> uh, but, so we can start like a whole fire over here for distraction or... Oh shit, no, we're gonna have to do that, aren't we? I don't know where the keys are. Ooh. I will take free change. Unless... Ah, here we go. There's the key. I will take this. So yeah, we can go in there and like take the hose. We can get a gas canister and all that. Blah, blah, blah. But we can... Hack. The, yeah, you know, just hack the telephone pole. What the? What's going on? Because for some reason that does something. Hello? Does anyone copy? Where'd that kid get to? I don't know. That's so crazy. Where did that? Oh, you rat bastards. Kid did this. Damn. He can't be far. I'll check behind. He, you got the key. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The keys for the handcuffs. Come, come on. Get ready to run. Oh. Stop. Hands where I can see him. They moved fast. How unfortunate. This is another reason why I don't you fucking like Zoe. Yeah, sure. Believe me. Whatever. Please, please don't hate me. I didn't think. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'll go back to my father. I'll, I'll get my dad to save you. I'll say, um, I, uh, I don't know what I'll say. Look, maybe, maybe you should rest. You'll feel better. Just just try to get some sleep. And when you wake up, I'll know what to do. Okay? Oh my god, I can't stand her. <laughs> I really can't. You hear that? You're in hell. Oh! Whoa! Oh my god. Oh! Who threw the who threw the flashbang? Oh God! Oh, they're gone, but they'll be back. John. And with friends. John. 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 Let me out. There's Robert. That was the first time Please, I've seen the option for John. Us. That's funny. Got a second kid in here. John. I know John. John. This kid says he knows you. Young blood? Yes, it's me. Good to see you. Let me out. On, we have to go. Zoe, you're coming with us. Wait, how do you know? I guess because I've never gotten John right before I got in this. My father sent That's you? interesting. <laughs> Definitely not. This is so weird. We'll explain later, but right now, you and the kid have to split up. You, you, you risk your life for me. I don't give a shit about you, Zoe. Okay, Yogan. Time to move. Let's go. I, uh, I hope I get to see you again. I don't. Bye. <laughs> As if John doesn't help me, you motherfucker. What about me? <laughs> what the hell? What about me, John? You know me.
me! You couldn't help? You couldn't do anything? You motherfucker. That's what I get for trying to help you with your relationship problems. Oh my god, this is not good. Ugh. I believe this is Alex. Yep. Can you hear me? What's that noise? It's a bug messing with the connection. Mm. But don't worry. Prepubescent Einstein here is gonna fix it. Help me a sec, homie. I got a bug I need to fix. Uh, sure. Help me in return? Yo, we live in a quid pro quo society. What happened to altruism for the sake of altruism? But yeah, fine. I'll give you a little something something. Who are you talking to? Don't sweat it, Mr. Yu. It's just a hitchhiker. John, it's me! Mr. Ursus. He's a friend of mine. <laughs> Take this computer. I put a metal detector on it. Check the ground near the pole over there. Oh, okay. Should be some hidden keys to open the box and reboot the line. Petriacom hides their keys like a dog hides a bone. I guess so. Thanks, dog. I mean, considering it's you from your little. I do. Yeah. So, as I was gonna say, the fake emitters are all in place. Should keep those pigs busy for a while. Thanks, Alex. Look for the brigades. Ding, ding, ding. You win a chicken dinner, homie. I would love a chicken Don't dinner. Wrong, Alex. Wait, wait, my parents. Sorry, kid. Now's not the time. No, he just picked up Zoe in a fucking shootout. It was wild. Don't hang up. Home slice. Press the button again. Hello? I don't think that's gonna do anything. Too late. He's gone. Oh, for why is it raining now? <laughs> oh, criminy. Okay. I'm fine. Just a little frustrated. Why are you frustrated? I'm looking for info on my bio parents. They died when I was young. In the attack in 86. But I haven't come up with much. Sorry they died. Thanks. My mom, I mean my adopted mom, said I might not find out anything. But I didn't believe her. Is your adoptive mom? She's at home or on the road doing her job. Come on. Let's wait out the rain in the booth. In the phone booth? But it's so small. while since you two talked I used to call her every week but it's been a while yeah you should call her yeah well, I guess you're right oh. you didn't even dial <laughs> precinct 22 officer Fanny hello Alex is that you yeah it's me is everything okay what do I say? Just start talking. Everything's fine. I just wanted to check in. Also, like, do you just have a direct line to your mom's you? desk? Or are you calling you are, the, right? like, and you emergency number? You want. You know 911. Hi, mom. How are you? Yeah, I'm getting enough to eat. Thanks. I... I hope you find what you're looking for. I miss you, Alex. I... I miss you, too. Look, I should go. 
Oh, already? I'll call again soon. I promise. I love you. Bye. Bye, baby. There, was that so hard? Come on. It's cramped in here. I feel better now. Thanks for encouraging me to call. They fight for what they believe in. I can respect that. Mm. People say they caused the peak to collapse. But I think that's BS. You? No, they, they did it. People died because of them. I don't know about all that. I smell conspiracy. I still have a few things to clean up around here. By the way, there's a cereal bar in my bag if you want. Oh, yes, please. Thank you. Oh, and I can call you a taxi, too. Uh -huh. I hacked into Happy Taxi. Because I can. And got some free ride vouchers. A taxi would be great. It's as good as done. <laughs> and good luck on your journey, man. Hope you reach 96. Oh, good lord. Appreciate it, Alex. <laughs> A cab, you say? Don't mind if I do. Sorry about that. All right. <laughs> this is my favorite one to get. All right, we can pick a dinosaur magazine to read. I'll read this one. Dinosaur. Discovered an area. <gasps> wow. Does it come with a tape? Looks like it's supposed to come with a tape. Are you a dino person? Oh, it did! Nice! Oh. Hi! Before we get much further, I should let you know that I have some anger management issues. That's fine. Now you know. Thank you. So. Where are we headed today with Happy Taxi? Just north. Then just north it is. We sell scratch tickets if you're feeling lucky. Oh, sure, I'll take one. Good luck. Thank you. Wow. Now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Ooh. That was cool. Let's see who's contacting me now. It's a pager. This on your show. How did they get this number? Are you okay? Just a second. Okay. <laughs> mm. Cigarettes. Damn. Piece of no good son of a. Let it out. It's okay. I, I wasn't watching or anything. I'm feeling much better now. I'm glad. Go on and ask me a question if you want to. I know all kinds of things. Okay. Uh, how do you feel about the brigades? Hmm. You could say I'm not a fan. Yeah. Too radical for my taste. I saw you looking at my mags. Yeah. Are you a fan of dinosaurs? Yes. I won't get angry if you aren't. No, I am. I am, yes. Good. Speaking of dinos, have you seen this movie that came out? Gigantic Park. <laughs> if I say no? It's okay. I won't get upset. Yes, I have seen Gigantic Park. Mm. I'm not sure if I believe you. Why would I lie? about seeing a movie we can you can i'm honest hey yeah what is it lean forward i want to show you something <laughs> what do you want to show me jared <laughs> tucks hair behind here yeah that's a portable vcr oh 
Now I can watch tapes whenever I want. When GP comes out on VHS and Petria, I'll watch it every day. Oh yeah? <laughs> it's a very nice VCR. My daughter would have loved Gigantic Park. Would have? But she passed away. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, bad things happen sometimes. But I'll make it right. I hope you do. And in the meantime, I won't think about that terrible thing that happened to her. I'd become very angry if I did. Justifiable. Now, you should take a snooze. You're a teen and your brain is still developing. Yeah, I guess so. Ooh, all the way up. Thank you, Jared. we stop engine trouble happens a lot oh i see Ooh. oh low level night of the killer pineapples Uh. Uh. Sorry about that. Yeah, <laughs> no problem. It's uh, no trouble. I heard a noise earlier, like screaming. Uh huh. What was that? Oh, I don't know. You're not lying, are you? The VCR is warm. Uh. You watched one of my cassettes. Ye I I did, I'm sorry. Which cassette did you watch? One is very private to me. Killer pineapples? Oh, I see. That'll explain the screaming, all right. It's pretty hardcore. Yeah. <sighs> We've almost reached your destination. I hope you'll consider riding with Happy Taxi again. Oh, I will. Don't say that. I absolutely will. <laughs> I'd ride in Jared's taxi anytime. <laughs> uh. All right. Jared. Jared, Jared, Jared. What a guy. What a guy. Oh, this is open now. So let's go this way. Something new. Uh, yeah, if you tell Jared that you watched the tape named Lola, um, nothing good comes out of it. <laughs> um, <laughs> so I don't recommend you do that. <laughs> it's not good. It's, uh, it's not good. Jared won't hesitate. Basically. Um. Yeah. You will not hesitate, bitch. <laughs> but. Yeah. I 
I still love him though. <laughs> Uh, I still love them though. Oh look, more people are putting stuff on the walls. Uh, boat. Nice. And we'll take a nap. Now I'm wondering, so the options that we have left for escape is climbing into the truck, we can climb the mountain, or we can take the back tunnels. And I think that's what I want to do this time around. Uh, because we could basically just... It's one of the more safer options. So... Just a random guy eating what a burger. What are you doing here alone? Looking around. Don't be one of those kids sneaking into a truck. Believe me. That's a big ass burger. Miss. Now be careful out there. You hear? Snakes and drinks. Can I help you at all? Snakes and drinks. Let's go. I like that that guy is still standing there, even though the uh, the lady that helped us cross fucked off and like that whole thing was disbanded. <laughs> Although technically she's right here. Who wants to know? Have a nice day. Weird. Oh, hello. Yes, but I don't have enough money. Finding your freedom can be expensive. Maybe I should just give up anyway. Here. Oh, well, this helps. Thank you. Good luck. I hope you make it. Oh, you too. I'm not gonna need it. So. Hey, see that door back yeah, there? Yeah, 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 I see it. So you can try to force the door open or you can just hack. You can't actually force the door open, I don't think. I think you need to have the hacking in order to do it. so used by the government. <laughs> ah! Jesus Christ. <laughs> in accordance with April 14th, 1996, in accordance with recent rulings, the old tunnels will be closed and entrances demolished. Hmm. Nice. I won't say no to a flashlight, that's for sure. Going through the vents. I don't think. Oh, damn, we can't get in there. Don't have the lock picking ability yet. Let's go. I hope 
god we don't get caught. Like maybe turn the flashlight off while you're walking down a long ass hallway. I don't know, maybe that's just me. Oh. I thought you were a guard. Please, don't shine that at me. What are you doing here? My wife and I came down here to cross. These are our boys. She went up to look for a way out when we got stuck. At one point, we heard gunshots. Oh. She never came back. I'm so sorry. I don't know what we're gonna do. And our food is almost out. I hope you do. I mean, you could just go that way. I opened up a thing for you, but, you know. Good luck to you. Yeah, you too, man. Alright. Oh, crossroads, eh? Left. Good adventurers always go left. Oh, uh oh. Oh. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Run, 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 run. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. I had lots of time. I had lots of time. Freedom. Freedom. Nothing, Nothing is, is more, more important. important. But there are many others in Petra still, still looking, looking for, for it. it. Right, 63 days later. And their journeys have only just begun. Well, well. Welly, well, well. Well, that's it for that episode. This one was a bit shorter, not by much, but either way. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. We didn't get too much in terms of story stuff. We did learn a little bit about uh, John and that he is in a CB relationship with Fanny. And he knows she's a cop. We also learned that John is the one uh, carrying the, the illegal transmitter. Oh, and we learned that Jared's daughter died. So that was a lot to take in. So... I hope you'll join me next time uh, as we carry on. We're about halfway-ish through. And, uh, yeah. I had a lot. I'm having a lot of fun, and I hope you guys are too. And I will see you in the next episode. <laughs> Bye.